The last scanning option we're going to look at today is the business card. So we're going to click on the camera icon. We're going to switch across to business card. We're going to capture. And then from the capture button, we're going to crop the card to where we want it to go. So I'm quite happy with that. All right, so that's going to be the first one. I'm then going to capture again. And this time I'm going to capture the second one. I didn't choose the sensei so, or the auto capture, so that's why I didn't automatically do it for me. I'm going to then do a capture there in the bottom right hand corner you can see I now have two business cards that have been captured for me. You'll notice at the top it says business card. I could choose to clean it up if I needed to, rotate it if I needed to, but I'm just going to save the PDF. As it's uploading into the cloud now, you'll notice that it does not have a fill and sign icon or a commenting icon, it actually has a save contact icon. So when I click on this, I can actually save these contacts to my particular device. So you can choose the one you want, you can go and say continue, and you can see there that it has brought up all the information that I require, and then I can then say save. And it will allow um, Adobe Scan to then add those to my contacts. So now that Adobe Scan has saved it to our contacts, let's go and check. So we click on contacts and here you can see that it's got the contact details and all the information that is required. Thank you for watching this Adobe Scan tutorial. Here are a list of the other episodes in the same series in more detail.